All right, guys, demonstrating how we're gonna do a matrix setup for knee pain. So we got the power plugged in, we're gonna power it up, and we're gonna get blue and red tips instead of the white tips. The white tips are for program 10. We're gonna run a program 14 for the knee, or a 27 for swelling reduction, and a program one. So we got them plugged in here. You reset this dosage to zero, and we're going to be on program 14 or program 27. Today we're going to use 27 for inflammation reduction. It's a 15-minute program. We set the balance right in the middle there, all right? And then we go ahead and get the cups prepped. So they sit in water. They sit in a solution of 90% water, 10% isopropyl alcohol. And you just squeeze gently. You want these moist. You, if I squeeze it again, it's gonna drip, right? So you want some water in there for conduction of the electricity. So you just do one at a time, plug it in. <clears throat> Gentle squeeze. Plug it in. So there's gonna be two channels, there's a red channel and a blue channel, channel one and channel two, and it works similarly to how interferential works with the crisscrossing of the energy patterns. And then it has a sweep associated with it too, so the electricity will move throughout the knee area as well. All right, so we've got all four cups. Now we're gonna check the suction we're going to turn this to about 4 o'clock right there. And pulsation's off for program 27. And we're going to get you started here. Okay, Chad, we're going to zoom in right here on the knee. And we want to go... on vastus medialis. And then we want to go... just over the, the head of the fibula right there. Is that pressure okay for you? Yeah. And then we're going to reverse that. We're going to go vastus lateralis, IT band area, and then we're going to go catch just off the edge of the tibia. We're going to go right in a soft tissue right there. All right. And then we're going to put a pillow under her leg to support her. <clears throat> Okay, there we go. Beautiful. All right, dear. Do you want to lean back a little bit? Yeah, please. Okay. And we'll just kind of let the patient go back. We'll raise the Ooh. foot up, the leg up a little bit. It's good. Pretty good? Yeah. Okay. All right. And then back to the machine. We're going to get the power going here. So <clears throat> just repeat exactly what I say here. Okay, Mrs. Jones, I'm going to turn on the stimulation. You're going to feel a mild sensation, okay? Yes. Let me know when you do. Okay. And you're just gonna go very slow with this. Oh. Yeah. Right there. Okay, hold on. Just show this, Chad. So the cups will pop off sometimes. That's gonna happen not every single time, but most times, until they get seated properly. And when you put a cup on, what you want to do is you want to give it a little squeeze like this and put it against the skin, squeeze it a little bit, and then push it in. And, and it takes a second to catch. And you want to see how it kind of it bows a little bit. That's a good suction. All right. And then you look at the gauge and you see that it's at about... 13, we're gonna drop that down to about five or six. I usually go just over five, because you want enough suction to keep that cup in place. Okay, we're gonna increase the stimulation for you. Let me know when you feel just a mild stimulation. Okay, okay. I feel can I go a little bit more? Oh yeah. I wanna to try to get to about 20 if she can tolerate it. <clears throat> How's that for you? That's fine. Now I want to balance these by turning. See, I can change those. All right. Right about there? 
mild to medium. And then we're going to hit the, the sweep button, then the enter button. You'll see the time starts ticking. You can see phase scan right there, one of four. That means it's sweeping through four different programs. And then we'll give the patient one minute and then we'll turn it up just a little bit higher to her tolerance in one minute. 